two more. Okay, so the first game, I don't remember anything about it. Like, it says I played it, so I believe them. And it is like a way that I would play, but I don't remember this game at all. And this game was only 17 years ago, so that's pretty strange. Uh, this guy's 2200, so maybe that's why I don't remember it. Yeah. Okay, so I'm white, and opponent's name is Kurt Collier, 2200 feet A. We had sort of a funny Slav. So that's a funny Slav. That's a funny looking Slav. Okay, he took, and I can take on B7, but it says that taking the bishop is better. So that's what I did. It says white's very slightly better. I can't explain why I made any of the moves I made because I don't remember playing this game. But I played it over and it was really exciting. So, I mean, this is a great game. Okay, very slightly better for me. Doesn't like B5. Now I'm more than slightly better. <clears throat> There's a famous Bee Gees song you might have heard. More than slightly better. You are more than slightly better to me. Mm -hmm. What was wrong with the B5? That's eh, weakening. His king's here. You'll see later, too. Okay, I took. Engine doesn't like that. It says I should play A4. And then it says follow your own rooms, dummy. Rules. Okay, so I took. He played this. I played rook C1. That's reasonable. Knight C5. Queen C2. He played queen B7. Now I did a rook lift because I was stronger in 2007. I played rook g1. The engine agrees. I'm trying to stop his bishop from developing. Mm -hmm. And he played g6. And then I played rook g5. So now I'm stopping him from feeing kettowing because if he goes here, his knight's hanging. It says after rook c8, he's equal. He played knight d7. And... This is something I think I would remember, but I don't. <clears throat> I played a brilliant move here. And like, I would never play this move now unless it was like a one minute game. Then I would play it. But I wouldn't play it in a slow game because I'm no good. My opponent's ELO here was 22-12 feet eight. <clears throat> so white's a play and win. Oh, uh, let's see. Yeah, knight, knight d7 was too passive and shallow and pedantic. We have a lot of people watching, and somebody said I was on Chess TV, but I don't know why. <clears throat> I wonder if they answered my text, my message with, we'll put you on Friday night. Or is this Thursday night? I mean Thursday night. Mm, nope. They didn't say nothing. Yeah, I'm not sure. Okay. Let's see. The chat, the chat got it after looking at their engines. I mean, it seems like beat. And taking on B5 could do something better. Bam! Right, yeah. so with the knight. I couldn't figure out which piece. So. Yeah, I, I figured stuff out, which is, I had to calculate a long way ahead to do this. Mm -hmm. Okay, so he takes, because I'm threatening knight C7 check and pawn up. Rook takes. Man, that was a good rook lift. Yeah. Okay, so if he plays queen A6, I can play rook B8 check and my bishop's attacking his queen. Mm-hmm. So he can't move his queen to the C file or, or the B file. So he's got two moves. He's got knight B6 and queen A7. Those are the two moves he can play. Yeah. Plays knight B6, which he didn't do. Um, I'm sure I was intending to play queen B3. And then I can play A4, A5 or bishop A5. And the engine says I'm winning. So he played queen A7. And then Karen didn't know this when we got married, but she knows now. And if she doesn't, I'm going to have to teach her again. When you see this move, what will you know? I don't know. That my name is the Lord. Okay. I was going to say, you know, yeah. gun or whatever. Mm -hmm. God with a gun. Yeah, that too. 
So what move can white make that would make sense that I would be, you know, God with a gun? And, and my name is the Lord. What move fits that kind of, um, you know? Yeah, I'm looking. Puzzle Palm with the worst answer ever on purpose, though. Yeah, I'm not sure. I like Rook B7. Or no, that hangs the Rook. I like... Um... Now, if I hang a Rook, that wouldn't be like <laughs> God with a gun. God with a gun is you hang your queen. That's the move? That's the move. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> you forgot my name was the Lord. Let's see. Yeah, so he took. I took. Yeah. Played here. And I played bishop b4 check. He doesn't have a lot of legal moves. So he has to play knight c5 or queen c5. So he played knight c5. Check. Now he played king d7 attacking my rook. So the question is, Karen, mm -hmm. do I take the bishop or do I take the queen? You guys can vote in the chat. Stockfish 16 just changed its answer. It said one move, and now it says the other move. That took Stockfish 16 yeah. like a whole minute. Yeah, I don't know. So that's pretty tough, right? The answer is it doesn't matter. Mm. However, after thinking for over a minute, Stockfish 16 says this is better. Mm -hmm. But it actually thought the other move was better until it thought forever. Yeah. Then it changed its mind. That's what I played. Okay, so his queen's attacked. So he moved it, and I took his rook. Now I have the two rooks and the two bishops. I mean, that's I have way too much material for a queen. Okay, and the game ended quickly. And then he resigned here, because here comes rook d6 check. And if he plays queen a5 check, I play b4. Now it says I'm plus 10. I don't remember playing that game, but that was pretty exciting. It was exciting. Mm -hmm. Taking the queen also wins. This is very slightly better. It doesn't really matter because they both win so much. Okay, that game was played in the National Open in round one in 2007.